first degree AV blocks are often benign and are easily seen on an EKG or cardiac rhythm strip. They are caused because of a delay in the conduction of action potentials through the AV node from the atria to the ventricles. Remember that normally, when action potentials are transmitted from the atria and through the AV node, that there is a slight delay before the electrical impulse is conducted to the ventricles. This delay is normally less than 200 milliseconds on a cardiac rhythm strip or EKG. In a first degree AV block, this impulse conduction through the AV node takes longer, and so this translates to a longer PR interval. The important thing to remember in first degree AV blocks is that Although there is a prolonging of the PR interval, there is always a P wave, which is eventually followed by a QRS complex. This differs from second degree AV blocks, where not all action potentials coming from the atria are transmitted to the ventricles. Some reasons why this might happen include, but are not limited to, structural abnormalities at the AV node, increased vagal tone, or even pharmacologic causes, such as from medications or drugs, like digoxin, beta blockers, and calcium channel blockers. And in rare cases, this can be caused by anterior wall myocardial infarctions, although in these cases, you could expect to see other findings on your EKG rather than an isolated first degree AV block. Regardless, the majority of the time, first degree AV blocks are benign and require no treatment. So in summary, first degree AV blocks are easy to spot on an EKG or cardiac rhythm strip. You'll see a prolonged PR interval greater than 200 milliseconds. And the good thing is that the overwhelming majority of these are benign and usually require no immediate intervention. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button or leave a comment below. I try my best to read all your comments for any feedback or ideas for upcoming videos. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so that you know when we release new videos. In the meantime, head over to our Patreon page and consider supporting this channel so we can continue to create and provide you with more great content.